Hello, YouTube. And it's time to face Quick Man. We. So, I guess it's time to go back to this game. I've recorded about, like, three or, I don't know, five, I think, Power to Laws, Oracle of Ages. So, I guess it's time to go and do this. Also, if you notice that the game is a little bit less blurry, I actually um, decided to now, now I'm recording the original resolution of the game. And also, this guy, this failure, he doesn't. You can't hit him. The only time to hit him is when he's doing that, or when he's moving, actually. Let's see, so the best way to counteract with this is pretty much. There's a few ways to do it. First of all, is to, when he's doing that, then always use a shockwave, or something ridiculous like that. Eh. That darn, I'm pressing the wrong button. This is fun. This is a very boring fight, actually, in my opinion. Literally, the fight is pretty much... It's not that that was badly placed. I never will make it. Let's put one right now, and then it will go and set off when he starts moving. See? Exactly. Perfectly timed. I'm horror... I have no idea why I'm, the one. I'm so horrible. Maybe it's a small screen, something like that. And never it's bad. Let's see, um, also using gut spam will help a lot during this ridiculous thing. So yeah, gut spam will help a little bit. We want to also, man, also it will, the best part is the fact that it will go and remove his spaces, so you pretty much have a guaranteed hit on him. Ah, uh, darn it, don't, stop pressing the pause button. I believe double needle is not hit does not, like, do whatever. Let's see. Not oh, darn it. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Okay, now the things are back, but I still got a good hundred damage in there. And I'll get a hundred more, actually. It's more likely I'll hit him with, uh, this guy. See? There you go. You're dead. Two minutes and thirty-five seconds in recording, and we're dead. Well, actually, 109 in-game, apparently. So we win! Quick man is the detonation program. We're all gonna die. Yay. Three, two, one. Boom. We all died. Game over. Um, wasn't the dam supposed to blow up? Oh, never mind. Protoman came here. Thank you, Protoman. So we made it. And we're not dead. And now Speedy Dave has been arrested, and we win. Hoorah. So, and then land pretty much gets, like, camera -ed. Yeah, we are, we are very proud. Land is a proud boy. He's a proud boy of proud he. First Arashi and now Dave. Well, they were just the bottom ranks anyway. The world will soon know the true power of gospel. Dark. Your time to shine has arrived at last. Pay me enough. I'll do whatever you want me to. Anything. Finally, I enjoy working with professionals. Okay. So, yay, we're sleepy and bored. Because we have absolutely nothing to do. And then a balloon appears out of nowhere. It's pink. You got balloon. So it's chip data, and it's from four. It's from a foreign country. I know how a balloon gets over here without popping, but okay. According to Mega Man Battle Network 4, Yum lands the entire ocean across, so I have no idea how the heck that balloon even made it here. So, okay, I'll take it. Uh, so, yay, we get to study the good foods of the world, we can go on... Yum land, and we might be able to go to Yum land. That's what land thinks. But we never end up in Yum land in this game, spoiler alert. <laughs> but we do end up in the net, at least. So, yeah, these kids are just running around. This is new robot here in town. We're holding up the children, their games. They're fun and games. Let's see. 
No, I believe now the next place where we want to go is we have to go to Yumland. So pretty much the best way to get there is to go and take this room. And then let's check in. We. So, with 200 HP, we can't really do much, but I think we can go in. We should go and buy a few stuff. I don't think we, we don't have any of the keys yet. We will get them a lot later in the game. But we do have a few good chips, like Time Bomb now on our side, to help us out with these battles. Just wait three seconds, and kablam, you win the fight instantly. Apparently gives it an S rank, but we can only get 200 cents from that fight. Brilliant. Also, with our new early earned cash, we can also buy a few more HP memories. Maybe even a power up. I think I should save it for the power up, but oh wait. I already went here. I already sold this guy's stuff. Ugh, it's been so long since I, since I did last, last did the part of this game. I believe the most recent one which I did was actually part 8, which was in the um, ridiculous land of whatever. Double Needle is extremely slow. I like. I like Battle Network 6's version of that, but we'll get onto that later. Oh, let's see. Oh god, we have a lot of stuff to deal with. So we have JRR. I believe best thing to do is to get rid of maybe a panel out, and then just do for a sub shockwave, maybe another shockwave for. You know, that, that works, actually. Actually, I think I can do some more stuff. Let's see, we have an attack plus 10, but we don't have anything else good. Yeah, we don't have much good stuff. Hardly anything here is good. Let's go. So, yeah, we have to take a ridiculous this path to Yumland, as usual. Yeah, no, I'm not gonna cheat my way through this anything. I'm not gonna cheat my way. If there's anything, that, that I won't do that. But, let's see, for right now, let's, let's go and murder Metar and Buddy. One shot kill. You died. And all we get is a zap ring. Not that I really care about zap rings, but okay, I'll take it. It's good father for the chip trader, which has come in. Which is now, actually, it's a new thing in here. Also, by the way, go up here. We might as well just use time bomb. We Let's go and wait for death. There you go. I've got a tank because I moved so much. Or whatever. You want to go up here, and before we couldn't get over there, and let's see, let's go to Yumland. Only those with an AL license. We have to get an AL license. Um, okay. Then, so sadly, we have to go and get an AL license. So we know exactly where to go there. How to get there? We it's time to get an AL license. Meh. No, stop pressing the wrong button. There, so let's go here. And then... It's time. It's this place. We can go over here since we have a BL license. And then automatically register. So I'd like to go to it. I would like to take this ridiculous thing. Oh god, we have to go and do some quests. There are three quests on the board. Darn it. So let's see, actually there are five missions. These two missions are, you can go here and do them if you want. Pretty much this one is um, pretty easy. This one actually is rather nice and it will give you an HP memory, so I'm going to do this. Let's go. So we have to go and take this thing. Let's see, viruses, nasty, blah blah blah. We have to delete a. Okay, so we have to delete a navi, which is in density. It's the easiest way to go. There. Nah. So let's see, yeah, we got, we got a chip trader now. Yes. I don't know who could this possibly be who says, huh, every single five seconds. But okay, let's see. So over here, chip trader. Three chips. And it gives you another one back. I was actually really lucky with that one. So we got it. We're cover 50. 
we. Is this our second recover 50 actually? Boom. So let's just go over here and then jack into the sword. Okay. Oh, so we have to do this ridiculous quest. HP memory, by the way, we can get them now. More of that fun stuff. Let's waste our money on that. Rather than a power up, which we can be using, but whatever. So, the guy is right here, literally. Right here. You're done. Okay, so the easiest, so you'll, you'll be scared a little bit maybe, maybe because there's, there's a new virus here. It's a met fire. Uh, I think we faced the issues before. We faced these guys already. But met fires are new. And you might be scared about that. They like to hide. They, and they do this. They go and start making fails flash, and then flashing means meteors, and I'm pressing the pause button wrong. Think again for the 90th time. Let's see. Let's go and do this. This will take care of both of them. As long as I keep the 50 at bay. And there we go. We're done already. That was easy. And we even got a Meteor 9. That's awesome. This ship is actually pretty nice, but in the in Balnor 3, it's a lot better. But but aside from Balnor 3, this is still a really nice ship. The 60 damage, and it can hit multiple times, rather than double needle, which will hit one enemy at one time. Yeah, so this is really good. We'll go and stick with it. So let's go over here. We're done with this easy quest. I think it was like four minutes, maybe. And we got an HP memory. Hoorah! Okay, so that was for an HP memory. And now, time for the next quest. Time to actually do mission one. So, yeah, we need help from a good bat virus buster. Yeah, we need to go to ACDC Town. Street, place, thingy. Okay, so let's go over here and at ACDC. So ACDC Town, let's go back over there. And there's a scientist waiting right outside the door. So let's go over here. And then there's three different navvies out there. We have to go and delete them all. One is right here. Yeah, the first one's over there, right there in that little robot. All these navvies are always hiding in the corner. And then the first one here will give you spikies. These guys aren't that hard at all now. Also, you can actually make it so that the spikies... Yeah, you can see how this works, actually. This chip is actually pretty cool. It will shoot actually exactly nine meteors, actually. Which is why the better versions are a little bit stronger and there, and also they shoot a little bit more, so you can get more damage out of it exponentially. Not exponentially, but a little bit better. So, I guess I can use my buster, spam buster. Yeah, whatever, just kill him with a buster. And we got Heat V, not that it really is any different from Heat Shot, it does the same amount of damage. And I prefer Heat Shot better. The Heat V can, can hit three enemies. Let's see if we can get any mystery data from here. There we go. So we got a rig up, and yay. Next place to go to is right here and jack into this Game Boy, I think. I believe this is where we're supposed to go. And same drill. No oh, way, we should get this Mr. Data. Horrible chip. And we get hit by a Canadum. We. No problem, Meteor 9 is here. There you go, one to kill. I got our cannon D. 
So, yeah, maybe that might help us. But handies. Three handies, actually. But with our upgraded buster, we this shouldn't be much of a problem. So yeah, this is a really tedious battle of easiness. Go and murder her until you win. I'm sorry if you hear a movie in the background. I don't know if you're going to be able to hear it or not. Ugh. And the very last Navi. Which is actually the hardest, I believe. This is, in my opinion, the hardest one. It's in the blackboard. So, right here, let's go in the blackboard. And right here, once again, there's another Navi. Hoorah. Going over here, actually, pretty much, just a Flamey 2 and a Flamey 3. The Flamey 3 will actually go and track you down, pretty much, in a sense. So you want to do this, actually. You want to go in a pattern. You want to actually go in a pattern, because then you would do this. And then, after you do that, then what happens is then... Yeah, try doing this, like this pattern. You have to go side, up, down, up, down. Pretty much by the time when he goes there, they can go here, on this other side. And you can kind of repeat the pattern, pretty much. Yeah, usually you have to place a tie bomb there that time, around that time. You want to at least. And now Now I missed. See, he does have 6 HP, so I can kill him. There, you're dead. Bye bye. Huh, <sighs> that, that was pretty easy. I don't really care about what in the world's in here anyway. If, if it was a rig up, then meh. Then I say meh. But we beat all three of the navvies, we're done with this mission. So yay, we gotta rank up one, and then... Once we finish the first mission. And we got a three HP memories. A nice little boost for us, our Mega Man guy thingy. It's like Pokemon all over again. So I guess we can go and take the third mission, and the second mission. Very simple request. And we'll do this next mission in the next part of Mega Man Bell Number 2. Bye bye.